Hey everyone, my name's Chris. I'm a full-time beauty pageant director as my career, but in my spare time, I'm a huge toy collector. I've been collecting toys now for over 40 years. You can officially call me a toyaholic. Now this episode is about me going toy hunting at a churchyard sale. I enjoy looking for toys everywhere. Toy stores, Ebays, flea markets, garage sales, thrift stores, estate sales, anywhere you can think of. I'm actually applying to be on the next season of MeTV's Collector's Call. I hope they come and film my massive collection for everyone to see and then they'll appraise it to see what it's worth. Now, if you like these types of videos of toy hunting and valuing toys, just hit like and subscribe for me if you will. I'm a baby YouTuber and I'm still trying to build up subscribers. And if you want to be notified for future episodes, just hit the bell. I was actually driving to the toy museum and I saw the Lutheran Church and Brandon was having a yard sale on my way there. Actually, I didn't film inside this church cell. It was too closed quarters to film. It would be really awkward. So I just started grabbing everything I wanted and they had some cute things here and there. And I ended up making a big pile and they gave me a pretty good deal. I got everything for $17.25, I think. And then I ended up donating the rest of the change of $20 to a church, to the church. So I actually spent $20 there. So I am gonna show you now everything I did buy. All right, well, let's look at it all. I got some really cool stuff. Now, I didn't notice this until I was walking out, but it was an inflatable Budweiser racing car at a church sale, but the guy said he had, um, had it hanging over his pool table. So I looked it up on eBay, and it's worth about $25 after you pay postage, and I paid $5 for it, so that was a pretty good find. I just picked up an eclectic mix of everything. I got some cute things. I got this Mississippi Braves bat. It's probably worth about $5. I'll add it to my toy collection. I got this cool little retro plastic boat, which came with a trailer. I'd never seen it with a trailer, so it's probably worth like maybe $5 to my collection. I got a little Ryan from Ryan's World. I'm gonna give him a little bath. I'd say he's worth maybe $5. I just keep adding to my collection and every dollar helps increase the value of the collection. Got a little Braves Beanie Baby. Um, I'd say he's probably worth about $5 as well. Then I got a, a Yoda. I'm probably gonna sell him at our flea market booth for about $4. I'll clean him up. Then I got this little Mickey Mouse Christmas ornament. He's got a string to hang on your tree or whatever. He's probably worth about $8. Then this Simpson car was the first thing I saw. I was so excited to see it. I grabbed it up right away and it was only 50 cents. And I'll just add that to my Simpson shelves. I love it. On eBay, it's $22 new. And it actually went all the way up to $65 new. But I'll value mine at about $12. I try to be conservative. Then I found this little guy. He was only 50 cents. I had to look him up with my Google camera feature, but he's Disney Zombie Zed doll. And um, the lowest on eBay, he's worth $20, but he went all the way up to $35 loose. So in my collection, I'm gonna go on and value him at about $15. Got this singing Ariel doll. I already have one in my collection, so I'll sell her for about $6 at the flea market booth. Then I got a little sequin Betty Boot bag for a quarter. I'll sell it at the flea market for about $3.50. This musical note got for a quarter. I'll probably sell it at the flea market for about $3.50. See what else I got. I got this Braves baseball with pictures of the players and their awards. I'm gonna keep that. Got this Disney Atlantis uh, lunchbox for 75 cents and it's probably worth about $20. I'm keeping that. What else did I get? I got a Darth Vader lunchbox. It was 50 or 75 cents, um, probably worth $5. Got a Nike bag I'm gonna sell for $5 at the flea market booth. Got this little M&M dispenser for a quarter and I'll keep him for my M&M collection. Probably worth $5. And then I got some little Axe spray. I'll keep those for myself. I think they were like a quarter. Got this cool mug, it might be Harley Davidson. I'm gonna sell it at our flea market booth for about $8. Let's see what else. I got this vintage gnome for probably like a quarter and I'm keeping him, but on eBay, he's valuable. He's like 28 to 30, $40. I'm gonna value mine at 10 to be safe. Got a little gnome ornament for 50 cents. He's probably worth a dollar. 
see what else. I got a little Daffy Duck tin. I'd say worth $2. Um, I got this chain just to use at our flea market booth. I got this old Star Wars figure, but he's all trashed and the stickers are gone. So I guess he's probably worth about $2. Got a lot of small stuff. A Hot Wheels blimp, probably worth $2. These two little dishes for a quarter I'll sell for probably $3 each at the flea market booth. I did find this cool Jetsons pen, enamel pen. He was 25 cents and he's probably worth about eight to ten dollars i'm keeping him so i'm gonna value him at five dollars just to be conservative then i got a minecraft figure he's worth about three dollars got a mini ro crown royal bag i've never seen one that small so that's probably worth a dollar and then um i got this jessica rabbit shot glass which i was so surprised at what it was worth on eBay, they were valued at $25 and $35 for that little bitty glass. I was just shocked. So I'm gonna value mine at about $12 to be conservative. Then I got this little kid's popper keychain, probably worth about $2. And I got a Princess Peach from Mario, uh, probably worth about a dollar. So like I said, I spent $17.25, but I just upped it to $20 to donate to the church. So when I looked up all the values and I added the values of all the toys I'm gonna to keep for the toy museum, that total came up to be $161. So then the few things I found to sell at our flea market booth come out to be worth $36. So that's a pretty great deal. I only spent $20. I'm gonna sell the few things I don't want at the flea market for $36. And then it's like I got all that stuff that's worth $161 for the toy museum for free. You can't beat that. Well, I hope you enjoyed our little toy hunting video. If these are the type of videos you like, just hit subscribe. Just search Value My Toy Collection. You can find us easily on YouTube. Well, I hope you enjoyed it. And until next time, we'll see you then. Bye-bye.